every year, thousands of people flock to Namgongo Mata's shrine to pray to the saints. This annual pilgrimage is now a part of 67-year-old Angelina Namgowa's life. Namgowa is a Tanzanian who has been coming to Namgongo annually to petition the saints since 1986. This is their time, hmm? the time when they really shed the, the, what, the blood. So we feel that we have to honor them by coming here, seeing is what is more of believing. Eh? Remember like even Thomas, Thomas after seeing Jesus, then he believed more. Eh? So even us, eh? okay, we say, yes, I'm believing, I'm believing. But when you come and you sit, you believe more and you get more and your faith becomes, it grows stronger. Namgowa, like many others, finds her way to the shrine of St. Chizito to get in a personal prayer before the Mass begins. The fervor with which the faithful present their petitions is a lesson in piety and meekness. Namgowa believes that although God hears our prayers, he takes too long to answer. Hence, her annual pilgrimage to talk to the saints. Not that we don't ask God, we ask God. Eh? But no, we are too many children to God. Eh? But now, when you ask this matter, since they are near to him, hmm, they do what? Eh? So they ask him. Hmm, and then the things become a bit faster than what you would have. To. God will give you, but it can take his time. But now when you go through them, at least the time becomes shorter. The Tanzanian pilgrim believes that 33 years of praying at Namgongo have benefited her life. My children, eh, they are all graduates, they all have uh, masters, so uh, that is one of them. Also my life, my health, because like now, most people don't believe my age. Eh? They don't believe my age, they think eh, I'm telling lies and yet I'm old. The Catholic faithful believe that the parable of the rich man and Lazarus shows us that the dead can intercede for the living, hence the multitudes that throng Namgongo. Many people come to Namgongo Mata's shrine to pray to the saints because they believe that since they were humans like us, they understand our weaknesses, our desires and our limitations and therefore can intercede for us with God. Gillian Nantume at Namgongo Catholic Matters Shrine. I will now hand you over to my colleague Joyce Nakato who will tell us about the importance of holy water in the life of a pilgrim.